What's up guys, how you guys doing today? So personally, I'm not doing so great right now because I don't know what happened last night, but apparently I lost my SD card and I have no idea where it is. And this isn't like any ordinary like 32 or 64 gigabyte SD card. This is a 512 gigabyte SD card and I spent like $300 on this SD card. So it is a super, super expensive SD card and I cannot find it anywhere. I hope I'm just tripping out right now and like I just can't find it at this very moment. I hope that I actually can find it later on today at some point because me and Lizzie just looked around for like the past 20 minutes, could not find it anywhere. I guess I lost it, which is kind of annoying. I I'm recording my other SD card right now that I use for my DSLR, but this is only like a 64 gigabyte. So it's like, it's not that big of a deal if you lose like a 32 or 64 gigabyte SD card, but when you lose a 512 gigabyte SD card, it's like a whole nother ball game. I don't know, we're gonna hit the gym right now and hopefully get a good workout in. I do hate complaining and I'm not trying to make it seem like I'm complaining right now, I just wanna let you guys know what's kinda going on in my life right now. The running shoes are destroyed right now, they got feathers all over them, paint everywhere. <laughs> Alright, you guys ready to bounce? Lizzie's got this black nose strip on her. She's about to peel it off. Apparently it hurts because it like peels everything out of your pores. Ew. Hear that? It's snap and pop. Ah. It like rips everything out of your pores. You can even see it on there. That's so gross. Ew, that's nasty. You're nasty. I'm pretty sure me and Chris are getting a haircut today after the gym, right? Yeah. We're gonna head over there. Yeah. We're gonna try and I'm gonna try and get one at least like every two weeks. Chris? Chris usually goes every single week to get a haircut. It's crazy, he's got to, he keeps up on it. All right, so I noticed something this morning. I went on the scale and I realized that I weigh the most that I've ever weighed in my entire life right now. I weigh 165 pounds, guys, that is not a joke. I need to get myself down, I wanna get down to at least like 150, maybe 145 if I'm lucky. That's, that's a lot of weight to drop, but I think I can do it. I'm just gonna not eat as much, try and eat a little bit healthier. I know I've said this a lot of times in my vlogs, and <laughs> I'm, I'm being serious right now, like I really need to step my shit off. Like I go to the gym every day, and I'm definitely gaining muscle, but it's like it doesn't even matter because it's not showing because of the fact that I'm overeating. But oh my God, that breeze feels so good. He weighs 145. I need to get down like that, man. I need to get skinnier. Like I'm building muscle, but it doesn't even it doesn't even matter right now. Oh, what's up, Alex? <laughs> what's going on? <laughs> you look like Alex right now, for real. Just got done at the gym. Lizzie's about to go to the pool, which I'm super jealous of right now because it is gorgeous. But me and Chris are gonna head over, walk over to this place and get a haircut right now. Chris just got a sprite because he was really thirsty on the way there. But look at this. I've never seen a sprite. Well, I've seen them before, but like, it's been so long since I've seen a bottle like that. They taste the best in the glass. Do they? Blends in with your shorts. <laughs> Holy shit, I didn't know you were that thirsty. You housed that. Dang, that was like, we literally just walked out of the place. Chris still has feathers in his hair from yesterday. How, dude, that's crazy. It's just like little spots, like you can see it like right there. Hey, you just got it done, I think it looks good. What do you think, Chris? Does it look good? You like it? You're up next, boy. Good luck. Hey, yo, it looks so good. Fresh, Dude, right? it looks dumb lit. Hell yeah. Why me and Chris have the same hair right now? <laughs> I'm kidding. Too fresh, All right, so Chris is going to get some more stuff done right now. I think he's going to get his eyebrows done, but he's going to wait a little bit for that. So I'm going to head back and uh, probably get a shower and get ready. All right, so this is my attempt at trying to recreate what the barber did to my hair. I think I got it down pretty well. I'm trying to get both this side and this side to look the same but it doesn't work with my hair for some reason. Like look at his, it looks the same all around. So like turn the other way too. Looks the exact same, like it all comes up. It's like one of my sides come down, the other one goes up, it's weird. We're gonna ride over to Starbucks really quick because apparently they released this new like rainbow colored drink and like everybody's going fucking ape shit over it. I wanna try it out. Apparently I've heard that it tastes like mango, so we'll see if it's good or not. So after we get that drink and try it out, I'm gonna head over to Best Buy. I'm thinking about either getting a Gorilla Pod for my Canon 5D Mark IV and trying to vlog on that thing, or I might just buy like a uh, like a Sony A7. I'm not sure exactly what I want to do yet, but I do want to improve my vlogging quality a little bit if I can. All right, so that's what it is. It's called the Unicorn Frappuccino. Let's try it out. Wait, it says it's flavor changing too. So we'll just be drinking it and then randomly get a different flavor. I'm trying to see how they make this thing. Yeah, definitely making it right now. So they put like the syrup on the side of the cup. So confused. He's like, how the hell they do this? Yeah, there it is. 
this is like, damn, that look is lit. I didn't want it at first. Yeah, but it, it looks good. Oh, it just got better. Yeah, it did. And there it is. That is what it's looking like. Apparently, the lady said it's, it's a little sour, so we'll have to wait and see. I'm gonna wait till Chris gets his to even try mine. I'll try it at once. All right, you guys ready? Let's try it. My taste a little bit like coffee. I taste the sour bit. It's such a weird, like, distinctive taste. I can't really tell. I don't know. It tastes like a little bit like candy, but a little mix of like, like, it definitely it tastes really strong caramel. That's for sure. I just, I can't, I can't really describe it. It's all right. Like, I don't think it's like it's not amazing. It's cool looking, that's for sure, but it's all right. I said it tastes sour to him. I'm not sure what it is. So this like sugar or whatever it is at the very top is super, super sour. I definitely noticed that. Chris doesn't like it anymore. Like I think he's gotten to the point where he's like, yeah, this isn't that good. <laughs> he feels like throwing it away. Point. Chris tossed his. This is so weird because it's like almost growing on me. The more I drink it, the more I'm actually starting to like it. It's really, really weird. You know, I don't know if you guys have ever had something <laughs> that like you've tried before and you didn't know if you liked it or not. Yeah. But it's like one of those things where I didn't know if I liked it or not at first, but the more I'm drinking it, the more I'm starting to like it. I'm trying my best to break this down and like differentiate the different flavors, but the blue is definitely sour. Like I definitely pointed that out for sure. So if you guys ever have this and get to the blue part, it's super sour. Ugh! I got to the bottom. Woo! That is sour. I finished mine. But let me tell you, when you get to the very bottom of this drink, Everything like collides together. It makes your face cringe, man. It's nuts. <laughs> Ew, I don't like it. Ugh. Like, I feel like that's... Okay, look, look. Ready? Try it. <laughs> that is... is it just me or does it taste like actual puke? Right there. I don't know, just... Is it's just so there? sour. It's like straight malic acid. That's what it tastes like. All right, so this is the last thing I'm going to say about this drink. So, I tried it in its entirety. Do I like it? I still don't know. I, like, I really don't like, it was good, but it wasn't at the same time. So that's my final answer. I, <laughs> I can't really describe it. A couple times ago, I came here, and you guys remember, I got one of these tickets, and I brought my finger back, and I literally had the biggest booger on my hand. It was the most disgusting thing ever. But here we go. Somebody straight up picked a big ass booger. This thing was like as big as a loogie. Just and just wiped it on there. It's like, yeah, I'm gonna get the next fucker who pushes this button. This elevator is huge. You can sleep in here, man. Right, you can put it in front Like Chris Chris was just saying, if we get stuck in here, it's not even that big of a deal. Cause like Yeah, every everybody can sleep in here. Alright, so I'm looking at some Sony cameras. I might go with the A7S Mark II, but not really sure because I have the A7R or I can go with the A7S, but the A7R is for more like pictures. Um, the megapixels is a lot higher megapixels, but this is more on the range of what I'm looking for, which is videography. Stay tuned. We'll be back at Best Buy returning in about two days. Two days? Yeah, every time you get a camera to change to, it's returned within two days. No, I return a lot of stuff, honestly, because like I think I'm going to like it at first and then I don't like it and then literally like a month later, I'll come back and get the same exact thing because I'm like, all right, you know, let's try it out again all right so this is kind of like how my setup would be I just hit myself <laughs> in the face with it I'm clumsy uh, but I mean this could work and it's not too heavy to the point where like when I was recording my DSLR before my uh, Canon 5D it's just like that was way too heavy and shaky is it still doing it? yeah why is your voice sounding so deep I don't know bro I hear it through yours it's not it's not my phone I think it's your phone messed up bro. Then call my phone. Then calls me on FaceTime his, and his voice is just mad deep for no reason at all. <laughs> it's normal now. Maybe it was my phone. That's so weird. The guys are trying to go look for the camera for me right now. They didn't have any out here, so I went to go look in the bag. But he's been bad there for a while now. Like, I don't know if they have the camera. Like, ironically enough, this happens every single time I come to Best Buy. They never have anything that I actually need at that time being for some reason. I don't know why. I think it's like only happens to me whenever I come to this store. But we'll wait and see. All right, so we just ran some more tests. I was going to go with the A7S Mark II, but after thinking about it and looking up some reviews, it seems like this, which is the A7R Mark II, is a lot better with autofocus and stabilization. So I think I'm going to go with this. The only thing that's really different is, honestly, the ISO goes up a lot higher on this, which means that, like, super dark pictures, I can see, like, almost like it's complete daylight. 
compared to this one. I mean, it, this this is still really good, but this takes way better pictures in low light. But of course, I'm more worried about video, so this might be my best bet. We're looking at lenses right now, and this one lens was broken, but look at this. It's not broken on the outside. That's like an inner crack somehow. I have no idea how that happened. Some premium glass right there. All right, so this is what I went with the A7R Mark II. We're gonna set it up right now. What's up with this filter? <laughs> <laughs> wait, but watch. Wait, watch what I can make it do. Give me one second. <laughs> That's funny. Funny story. Best Buy closed about like 10 minutes ago and we're still here. Uh, big shout out to the guy helping me set up this camera though, the Best Buy employee, because honestly, he helped me a lot and there's a lot of settings on here that I didn't even know about, so everything should be perfect by the time I start vlogging on this camera. They're starting to shut lights out. All right, so this is my very first time recording on the new camera. I hope you guys like it. Leave me a comment down below of what you think the quality and the sound is like. Like if you guys like it, if you guys hate it, let me know. Obviously, like I definitely like the wider angle that I get with this compared to my little pocket cam, my G7X. But we are gonna try and get some food right now. We've been in this store for the past like hour and a half. I'm not even kidding. The store is completely closed right now. There's like nobody in here besides workers. But uh, let's get it. We're gonna go get some food at Cheesecake Factory. So it should be fun. Chris just got in the elevator and Lizzie wasn't in there. We had no idea where you went. You went down the escalator. Yeah. We didn't know where you went. <laughs> we were so confused. Lance ran something over and we can hear it when we're driving. I think it's the back wheel. Is there something on that? I don't see anything. What? Did it just come off in front of us? It came off. Oh, I guess it came off. All I had to do was go in reverse. <laughs> okay. So whatever that thing is right there, that was what I was dragging. I'm not really sure if you guys can see it. Is that just a bag? I don't know what that is. All right, so this is gonna be Chris's very first time at Cheesecake Factory. How you feeling? Pretty good. Pretty he just wants some pasta. That's what he told pasta. me. Did you ever get your, your salad toss too? <laughs> I just think it's my salad. That's good. <laughs> I just got this camera and I'm using the battery that came with it and it comes with like a minimal charge. So I literally only have 1% battery left on this camera. So I might be switching back over to my G7X in a couple of minutes. All right, Cheesecake Factory. It's probably a long wait. We have about a 25, 30 minute wait, so we got this little pager. We're gonna walk around right now and then come back when it is time. This is so beautiful. I love always coming here and looking at this. It's a little water show. They, they usually shoot up really, really high too. What? Look at that. That is so awesome. It like bunches up at the top. I'm interested right now in this. <laughs> the is going off and it's vibrating right now. What are you gonna do with that? <laughs> Your vibrator? I'll probably get age restricted for that shit. <laughs> hey, we're about to get some food. So hype right now. Love this place. Funny story, we recorded a video here like two years ago and Chris was here with me and one security guard that kicked us out of this place, he was just staring at us, like grilling us hardcore. So he probably remembered that instance. These floors are always so slippery. I'm just like, it just makes me wanna go like this the whole time. I look like an idiot, but whatever. Switching back over to the G7X right now because my battery died, but look what it says. Battery exhausted. Like it's like it's tired. <laughs> that's so funny. They both got strawberry lemonade. I usually don't like strawberry lemonade, but I gotta admit that's pretty good. I usually get raspberry. Chris was just bugging out because of the fact that the strawberry lemonade actually has strawberries at the bottom of it. And he hates that. Like I had a fruit pop before. It was like an icicle pop with fruit inside of it and it was strawberry and it had strawberries in it and he would not eat it. He doesn't like fruit in his drinks and stuff. There's yogurt and it's got fruit in it. He doesn't like it. Mm mm mm. Four cheese pasta. And Chris just got regular spaghetti and meatballs. Still waiting on it though. This place is dead. There's like absolutely almost no stores open besides like Cheesecake Factory, which closes pretty soon, actually, too. But like, look at this. I've never seen this place so dead before. It's pretty crazy. It's really weird how much bigger a place looks when there's no one in that place. So Chris is always doing some crazy shit with his hoverboard. Look what he's about to do. He just tried this and busted his ass. <laughs> We're all about to go on a board ride right now. I'm using the G7X right now just because it's a lot easier to carry around, especially when I'm riding a scooter. Chris has been Chris has been trying to go on a board ride for the longest time and I felt so bad, but we're finally out here right now. Me and Chris are switching now. Maybe I can actually get some footage now that I'm not on the, uh, <laughs> on that thing. It's hard. Dang, man, I miss riding this thing. It's fun. We're just riding around reminiscing back on the old days, bro. Reminiscing, bro. Like two years ago? No, 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 like a year and a half ago with these board rides. It was lit. We're actually trying to get Russell 
and Cody to come out here so we can go on some more board rides, maybe pretty soon. Yo, Chris, come take this board back, bro. I just busted my ass. I don't want to ride this shit no more. There's something wrong with your board. It's so wobbly. I'm taking this back. <laughs> we tried doing this with Nick's board before, but it didn't work out that great because he doesn't have Bluetooth. We thought he did, but, but Chris's board does, so we're going to play some music through here. All right, so it doesn't look like the Bluetooth on here is working either. I don't know if it's because this board is like old now and all worn out. Maybe it effed up, I but. Maybe it's because Chris is old and worn out. True. You know what I'm saying, bro? Yeah, you know what he's saying. Bro. <laughs> Chris, do you remember this spot? Dude, all right, so this is where we found a random chair and we used our hoverboards, I believe, to push the chair with Cody in the chair. And Cody was in the chair, <laughs> and there was a fucking, one of these big ass branches laying in the middle of the road, and Cody tried going over it and fucking fell. Face planted, I was laughing the hardest I've ever laughed in my life. It was hilarious. It was the greatest movie ever. You guys gotta go back and watch the old, old, old vlogs. That's where the fun is with the board rides, man. We gotta get back on that grind. Fuel it up! Oh! Holy shit! You just ran into Big Nick. Yeah. Nick, we need to get you a booster seat. <laughs> yeah, bro, I, that was fucking scary. <laughs> hey, yo, what up, dogs? What up, dogs? What's going on? Board ride is a wrap. We're gonna go back up now. Oh, dude. I knew you were gonna do that, so I started. <laughs> All right, guys, it is getting really, really late, actually. We're gonna chill out for a little bit, and then I'm probably gonna go to bed. So hopefully you guys enjoyed today's vlog. That if you like did, a good idea. <laughs> if you did, please hit that thumbs up button. Don't forget to turn on my post notifications so you never miss a new video. <laughs> All right, I'll see you guys next time. If you guys are interested in any of our 210 merchandise, make sure to click the link down below at the very top description. Check it out over there. Make sure to hit that subscribe button and turn on my post notifications. And if you haven't already, make sure to check out yesterday's video as well. Ha 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 ha!